Hi, I'm Chris. And I'm Cynthia. And we're the Hanya family. And for those of you that are new here, welcome and let's enjoy some great music together. All right, so what do we have for our Goonies today? Well, today is Sunday and because it's still the weekend, we're doing our Canadian content for you guys today. Um, this one was on our list. It's a band that we've done a few times already. The band is Metric. Metric. Yep. Um, this is a newer song, apparently, of theirs. We haven't heard it before. Yeah, the video on YouTube is only five months old. Yeah, it's called Just the Ones. And the person who asked for this one is Kevin Dobson. Yeah. Well, I mean, we have been checking out uh, Metric, mostly because of Kevin Dobson. Yeah. And, uh, <laughs> well, it's a Canadian band, and uh, they sound pretty good. So uh, they kind of remind me of Blondie. Yeah, a little bit. I wonder. A little bit. Mm. Well, that's somebody that Kevin also likes. That's yeah. true. That's true. There are definite similarities there in that way. Mm -hmm. just, just in the you know physical presence way, not necessarily the sound. Yeah, exactly. Uh, but uh, they're an interesting band. We've uh, enjoyed some of their music, so uh, we're up for more. Yes, absolutely. So let's check this one out. This is Metric with Just the Chance. Just the once. The Chance. <laughs> I don't, I don't know. I honestly don't even know where that came from. Just the once. Seems like the time. think of this one so far uh sounds really good except for the compression my only complaint is the vocal to be honest yeah um the music itself i'm really enjoying it like the bass line mostly actually yeah if i'm uh well i mean I'm saying you're kind of forced to hear it because of the compression it's the bass line that's really doing it for me though other than that this is not um really that great for me oh yeah it, it's just the way the vocal's being done, all the effects over it. You know what I mean? Uh, yeah, I find it's pretty, uh, the vocals are kind of... I mean, maybe it's not that. Maybe it's the compression that's making it sound like that. I think it's the compression because the vocals actually sound kind of thin in comparison. That's the thing. They do sound thin, mm -hmm. but they are they still sound like maybe there's some kind of weird effect on them. There might be a phasing or something. I'm yeah. not sure. I don't know. Um it's definitely, it's an effect, but it's an effect that you wouldn't hear with the music. Yeah, I don't care much for the, the way the vocal's being done. But mm. other than that, I mean, the music's pretty good, the bass line specifically. Mm. You know? It has a good groove to it, for it sure. It does, and, and the beat's pretty solid. Yeah. Um, I'm going to back this up a touch. Um, musically, uh, the only problem with the music, it's well played and all, it's just the compression is very high. I can hear it. Like, it's just... Yeah. That's always bothered me about today's music. And I... Yeah, a lot of it is too compression heavy. Yeah. So, you know, great that you want to sell it on the radio and all that stuff. But, you know, radio stations have their own compression. <laughs> yeah. Uh, they have their own, their own radio sound. Each station has its own sound. So, uh, 
you know, it, you just have to, why not just give it to them, you know, the way you intended and then and, and like without the compression, let them compress the hell of it themselves. Yeah, this you know? is, um, but it's good as far as the groove goes and everything. It feels yeah, yeah. good. It's good groove. Yeah. Uh, kind of simple, but, you know. Yeah, it's a good club type of thing, I would say. I Yeah, if people still play clubs. Yeah. <laughs> But uh, yeah, it's danceable. It's got a decent beat. Uh, you know, the singing's a little thin, but I, again, though, I, I'm, I'm not hearing any auto tune. No, it's just the way that I don't know. There's some kind of com not compression, but um, effects on the voice is what I was getting at. Mm. Yeah, some yeah, kind it, of effects there that I don't like. It felt thin, distant. You know, like uh, yeah, it's there, it's present, but it's it almost feels like it's a, you know, almost an afterthought, really. Yeah. But anyways, we should finish it up. Yeah. great danceable beat i like, like the a, guitar a good work. groove going on you know yeah i like that guitar groove yeah it's, it's really, really nice good. really it's got almost a disco feel to it it's the groove that i like with this song yeah disco you know? funk guitar uh, <clears throat> bass is like you said is really interesting yeah uh that's yeah. but that's where the distortion is it's like you're almost at the edge of that bass line going yeah you know you can hear it and it's, <clears throat> it's it's right there and it's about to scream at you but it doesn't that's the problem with compression it sounds like it's always yeah. urgent you know but for me the vocal is not really as good as it should have been on this hmm. it's a little weak sounding there's too many effects on it you know that kind of thing she doesn't yell at all no she doesn't I belt mean, it, th that entire all that sound seems to be coming from here not not there yeah it's just I think they're trying for too much softness, too much airiness in the vocal. Yeah. And it just doesn't seem to work for my taste. Mm. I prefer to hear a, a more full vocal in this kind of a song specifically. Yeah. You, you know what I mean? Yeah. And it would have <laughs> it would have the room for sure. Yeah. You could really, you know, make that thing blow up and, and be big, but she kind of keeps it under by not really pushing any of the notes. Yeah, you and know? I mean, the effects were unnecessary, I think, on the vocals. It's yeah. just the way I there feel There was a lot of color it. on that, like listening to the second half. I was yeah, it just doesn't sound natural. Her her yeah. vocal seems colored too much. Like delays you know? and reverbs. Right, and just exactly. Kinda, and then it's all cemented inside in like a gate, so you're yeah. not getting that runoff. And it just feels really small and tight. And really. most of the time, I find the vocal was inserted too far into the mix. Mm. Every once in a while, it was brought forward, but even when it was brought forward, there was too much airiness mm. and too many effects. It just it didn't work out. And I feel like they used compression to kind of push it up against the rest of the music, but yeah. it, it it didn't have that 
It didn't have what it needed. It didn't yeah. have the push. I mean, she wasn't really pressing. Like She was singing from here. Yeah, like, that's kind of how it feels. Like, yeah. Like bathroom singing. You know? <laughs> but this was a good request anyways. I really did enjoy that groove. It, it was, was a great quite groove, awesome. For sure. I, I, wonder what yep. she was, I wonder what this band would sound like live because it would be... It would be I a wonder, little different for sure. Yeah, I wonder. It would be a lot harder to not you know, push a little bit harder on a live act. So. Maybe we should check that sometime, see if they do a good live performance. Mm. Yeah. But anyway, this was a good request, so thank you very much for that. It was definitely appreciated. Please don't forget to check us out over on Patreon. It's $3 a month, and we're adding things there all the time. Also, like and subscribe to the channel and become one of our goonies. Share with your family and friends. Click that notification bell if you don't want to miss a video. And don't forget to enjoy yourself. Later. Later.